Good morning. Good morning. As you can see, look at this place. Look how spotless it is. Because we are, we are on our way to jump into cab to Stockholm and my brother is sometimes very critical on me. He says, I'm useless, I'm always late and I'm just a bad human being. So since he's at work, we try to like really clean up the place and make it nice. No way. I can't believe Team Chaos cleaned up their mess. It was about time you learned what I said to you. Gotta say that. I gotta thank you for cleaning up. Appreciate it. There was a few spots on the floor though. I'm not sure but if I should invoice you for that. But it was good having you. Uh, and for all of you viewers, I think, I mean, I made the vlog, I keep saying vlog, but it's vlog, vlog. I made the vlog, vlog better than it was before. And I guess all of you will miss me, but I'll be back someday, somewhere, someplace, whenever. This is me, Lion Man. Hans Olsen, over now. Good having you in order, Team Overkill. See you soon, Macaroon. It was great having you, Hans, and let's plan more things together, because it's fun to hang out with my brother, especially since he's kind of a character. But now it's time for us to put down this rag. Hopefully, yeah, Hans was happy, because we have a taxi waiting outside, so we gotta move, get our bags. But carrying bags today is not feeling that great, because my ribs are feeling pretty terrible, because last night, we decided to walk to the top of Aura Mountain. So we have these like really light skis with skins on mm -hmm. and we're gonna see if my ribs will enjoy this little hike. Hans yeah. says it's very mellow and that we'll be okay, but I just can't sit still, that's so boring. But it's the first time for me in uh, ski touring gear. We have Mr. David Kantemo. Me and David, we have a, a long past. We lived together in Yerpen at the ski academy and then we built jumps, skied for a lot of years. Yeah. So I would say that David's probably, I would say that you're the oldest friend that I keep in touch with. But today we're gonna hang out, spend some quality time together, and just do like kind of grown-up activities and walk up instead of taking a helicopter or a snowmobile. <laughs> 10 years ago, we would have illegally taken the snowmobiles to the top. I and actually they... have mine in the bushes, just <laughs> as from here. So. Of course you do. <laughs> and Benny, have you skied toward? I never. Hopefully my ribs will stay together. I don't know how smart of an idea this is. Uh, wait, wait, wait. Ready, okay, ready. I was just saying, like, right here. Here? I had the RS6 DTM completely stuck in the snow and we had to dig for four or five hours to get it back on the parking lot. But why did you take it all the way here? Well, I, I thought it was like hard enough to get up there so I took full speed <laughs> onto the snow. No way. Made it here and I, we actually had two <laughs> snowmobiles come to help us, didn't work. And then we had the snow cat, it was just stuck. Let's begin. Where you're walking from? Okay. Look at it. Wow! Life quality. Yeah, I'd say this was a good idea for Mr. Hans. Yeah, thank you, Hans. Thank you, Team Active. Chocolate. Is it from the greatest Aura chocolate factory in the world? Having a chocolate on the top of the mountain in the sunset. Are they hotel? So, this is 1,420 meters above sea level. And we're in good hands. I would say that David has been on the top of this mountain the most out of any person in the world the last 10 years. <laughs> if there's 10 centimeters of snow, people have found the snow on the mountain and then made a great turn and made it look like it was the best ski day in the world. You should follow David's Instagram if you want motivation on how to live an active life. Yeah. I saw a lot of questions. Is the GH5 good at photos? I'm gonna put a link below and you can check out some uh, photos that we took today. Thanks for the view. It's nice, huh? Oh, yes. Can't believe you're so excited. This is everyday normal day in order. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so happy. I love it. Now, what's your favorite part, Benny, going down? No! Uh. <laughs> 
Bandy! Oh. I've never had this in my life. <laughs> you know what we say? No. Speed is your friend. Uh, I don't trust these keys. Oh, yo, 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 me and David were like, hey, let's just like walk up to the top of Aura on the way back to the village. So we walked for like five hours just to look at the snow. We had a great time. That we did. And we got down, the hangover was gone. True. And you still have the same amount of energy 20 years later. But now my hand is freezing off. Yeah. Are you tired? Uh, no, it ribs. No problem! <laughs> you can do it! Almost down! <laughs> nice! Why is it supposed to be so painful for me? <laughs> they say practice makes perfect. It's it's nice to ski with people that aren't professional every once in a while to remind you that practice does make perfect. But we had like the best night I've had in a long time and oh. I'm sure you understand why. We're gonna end today here so that we can come back tomorrow, which will be today in the vlog. Oh. Got my high five for today, Benny, you killed it. Yeah, high five everybody. Let's do more of this. For sure. Good initiative. Yes. Yeah. Benny, good job. Hey, thanks. Thanks good so job. much. Now let's jump back to tomorrow. Ah. Oh, so what did you do to me? Totally worth it either way. Yeah. Can you feel your legs? No, not really. My legs are sore from yesterday. Voila. Perfect. Okay. The worst part about ribs is not having broken ribs. It's like watching Maria carry my bag. It's okay. Good thing Maria is <laughs> way stronger than I am anyway. Thanks for having oh. us. It's so nice to have you here. It's gonna be so empty. Yeah, it's hot. So come back. <laughs> I know one who's gonna be super surprised when he's coming home. Super happy. Good. Don. Every day you can impress your brother is a great day because that is not easy. <laughs> <laughs> ciao, ciao, ciao. Have a safe trip. Yeah. Bye bye. Travel. Is that everything? Yes. Okay, now we have one mission, and one mission only. Which is? Which is to go to the FedEx depot here at Orlando because I have a document I needed to send urgently, but you can't send it from Aura. And you know when you need to send stuff, like urgently, and you can't send it, uh -huh. and you have to send it? And it's frustrating? Yeah, it's like you just want it out of the way. So that's step one of today. Come on, UPS, open. Is I it closed? Have, I have called the person, I ah. think they're coming. This could be like, nice. Can we know what is inside? Yeah, it's a bunch of documents, like car registration, annoying, boring stuff. You know, the kind of stuff you really don't want to deal with? Mm -hmm. And then you have to get it done, and you have to send it? How long have you been dealing with this? Like, forever. Come on, UP. Ah, perfect. UPS. Thanks for the Monaco. Thanks, Done? Sending papers to Monaco. A nice 100 euro. No. It's cheaper to fly. Now we can get back to life. Yes. Starting route to Miss Clara by Novus. Strålande! Ja, okej. 
Perfect! This is my least favorite elevator to shoot in ever because it has the blinking lights. <laughs> but it's my favorite hotel, so it's okay. Oh! I feel like I've stayed in this room every time. Oh ho! I gotta jump on the computer. I have too much work to do. Me too. No sleep for the wicked. No. Nope, nope. The more you work, the more stuff you get done. And it's not really interesting to sleep. It's more interesting to work. Yeah, sleeping is boring. Resting and sleeping is boring. Yeah. But I wish I would have rested last night because walking to the top was a terrible idea. But what did you tell me just before? If you had to do it again? Uh, yeah, I would probably do it again. Like <laughs> it was really nice up there. Totally worth sucking on trying to move things. We need some painkillers. Yes, and I need some uh, blister killers. <laughs> you should see his feet. The fact that he moved up is like, that's trooper style. <laughs> I think having a broken ribs is even worse. No, 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 no. Broken rib you can chill with. Every single step when you have a bleeding blister on each foot, like yeah. the size of this. Yeah, Benny yeah. was like, ah, it kind of hurts on my feet. It means he's tough. <laughs> Let's put it this way. With Benny's blisters, I would have taken off my ski boots and walked uphill barefoot in the snow. Okay, get organized. Oh, <laughs> I have an idea. Yes. Let's put the camera down for an hour or two so that we get some stuff done. Perfect. You know what the best thing is about having four vlogs a week instead of seven? No. <laughs> This means that we have a little bit of time over to actually think about things we can do better with the vlog. And we realized that we said we were gonna do a Q and um, question of the day every day, but then every day so action packed that we kind of like forgot about it. That doesn't mean we, we don't want to do it, but we figured out that we can do it better than we have in the past. So instead of us just picking a random question, I think it's better if you guys leave good questions, then I will look at them and whatever I think is good questions, I will send you guys an email and then you can just call me on Skype and ask me the question directly or ask us a question directly. That's a good idea. I think that's way more personal than just reading a comment. So um, if you want to give me a call and like chat face to face, yeah. then, then leave a, um, a good comment. And I hope you guys think that's a good idea. It's way more fun to, you know, see who's asking the question yeah so comment below and we will pick whatever's good shoot you an email and connect that way but with that said i think you know the sun is about to set we uh munched in a bit of a crook monsieur <laughs> this is super <laughs> but now I am kind of tired to be honest that hike last night was uh, a bit energy draining but absolutely fantastic that's something we should do a lot more since we are tired I say that we say ciao and we will see you guys uh, the day after tomorrow oh you have to finish and say ciao in Swedish we always forget about this that we also do <laughs> so då ska vi avsluta på svenska hoppas ni gillar vloggen uh, helt fantastisk kväll igår och en trevlig fin dag idag så nu har vi fullt med energi och vi är peppade att köra nya bättre vloggar framöver så vi hörs i övermorgon ciao Ciao, I didn't get anything. <laughs>